India just made a massive leap in AI and quantum computing. At an event packed with the country's top science leaders, CDAC unveiled some of the most ambitious tech products we have seen yet. From quantum platforms to universal compilers and even indigenous supercomputing servers. But still, if you want to ask, what's the big deal? Let me tell you. And let me also tell you why are these announcements so important. Let's break it down. In the presence of national tech icons and policymakers, CDAC launched three major initiatives that could reshape India's place in the AI and quantum race. Qniverse, India's quantum OS. Let's talk about Qniverse first. A unified platform for quantum computing designed to support multiple architectures and hardware. This is India's big bet to make quantum development mainstream. So whether you're a, a research lab, enterprise or a student, Qniverse helps you go from Schrodinger's theory to real-world application. Think of it like India's own version of IBM's Qiskit, but for all. Paras, code once, run everywhere. Paras is not just a compiler, it is a vision. It's built to support CPUs, of course, but GPUs and TPUs as well, and also AI accelerators. With unified programming, Paras lets you write code once and deploy it across any device. In a world fragmented by chip types and AI hardware, this is a serious play for developer productivity and efficiency. As I said, code once, execute on all. That's Paras for you. Rudra 3, indigenous modular supercomputing. Now here is the bombshell. Rudra 3 servers are India's answers to the future of HPC, that is high performance computing and AI infrastructure. It's built in collaboration with VVDN Technologies. These modular open compute project inspired servers come in 2AU form for HPC. Backed by AMD's latest CPUs and GPUs, they are designed for both supercomputing centers and enterprise data stacks. This is not just make in India, it's scale in India. But what can be the grassroots impact of something like this? Let me tell you. Sovereign compute power. Whether it's quantum experiments or training LLMs, India's reliance on foreign platforms is unsustainable. CDAC's rollout shows a clear shift. India now wants compute independence. With data residency, AI safety and national interest at stake, you don't want your critical workloads running halfway across the world. Tech for all. These tools aren't locked behind VC firewalls or uh, enterprise licenses. They are being built with the ideas that Researchers, students, startups, everyone can participate. From Paris to Quiniverse, the goal is clear. Level the playing field for all. Global AI competitiveness. Countries like US and China are throwing billions at AI infrastructure. India, we are doing it our way. Open source inspired, modular, cost effective and scalable. So India is not behind in the race anymore. India is carving its own lane in the global AI and quantum race. So what can we expect next? Qniverse becoming the go-to platform for India's quantum research. Paras will be simplifying development across diverse hardware and Rudra 3 will power the next generation of AI models. And India will be showing the world what sovereign tech innovation looks like. India's tech stack is literally evolving fast. And with CDAC leading the charge, we are no longer users of AI and quantum. We are builders, innovators, originators. So if you're a builder, what would you build with this? Tell us in the comments below. Tag a quantum enthusiast or an AI builder and share the video with them. For more such deep dives into India's tech and AI frontier, subscribe to AIM TV because think AI, think AIM.